Welcome back guys for some more Pokemon Go and happy spooky season. So today the Halloween event starts in game so I thought it was the perfect opportunity to actually come out and you know start filming some videos for you guys again. I know I'm still at home at the moment but that's because I've just found a shiny crow gunk. So it's a nice way to start off the video. I did just get out of the shower you know to get ready to actually go out and sure enough we've opened up the game and claimed ourselves yet another couch shiny. This seems to be where I get the majority of my shinies today, if it's not com day, just sitting here on the couch. So we'll check the IVs. Unfortunately, it doesn't really have great IVs, but that's okay. It's still a shiny to start the video off. We do have some new shinies to actually hunt during this Halloween event. Unfortunately, Niantic has locked them to eggs for now. For the second part of the Halloween event, we do actually get a shiny Punky Boo, but... We have to wait until the 27th for that to start but that's okay we still have this stuff to do we do have special research to complete as well so hopefully we can get some encounters with some shinies and stuff like that so onto this first part of the research we need to catch 40 uh, ghost type pokemon make nine curveball throws which i've already done three of and 49 nice throws so nice easy stuff to do the rest of the research pretty much follows the same suit. We need to catch like 40 or so ghost types in each part of the quest. There's only three parts where we actually need to do something. And then the last part is just collecting some rewards like usual from this stuff. So nice laid back, easy quest. Shouldn't be too difficult to get done in the time that we have allotted for it. We do have seven days for this first part of the Halloween event. And then during the second part, we do actually get, like I said, shiny Punkaboo and a few other things, a few costume Pokemon like Ninetales and Volpix and so on. So yeah, actually some interesting stuff to get through of this Halloween event. Unfortunately, Spiritomb is not available at any point during October, which is unusual. Lucky enough, I actually got my shiny last year. So yeah, I'm one of those people that actually has the shiny. So it doesn't really worry me too much, but unfortunately, yeah, for other people, no shiny. So yeah, I'm going to head out. Hopefully we can get ourselves a shiny uh, Yamask this year, because that is one of the ghost types that I'm still hunting, and they are spawning in the wild today. So yeah, we have ourselves a mission. So I'll head out there. Hopefully we can find some more shinies, and I might chuck a few eggs on as well. I actually have a full stack of eggs at the moment from previous, so I have to hatch them first before getting any of the event eggs. I just don't like the way Niantic locks things in eggs and I refuse to give them money just to get shinies because I find that is a really low thing to do. So anyway, let's head out, let's get some shinies. I'll see you guys soon. All right, well, we've got this first part of the quest all nicely completed, ready to go, collecting these, to collect these rewards, I should say. Uh, so we'll collect our Stardust first get our pokeballs and our first encounter i'm pretty sure this is with your mask if i remember correctly looking at the graphic i only had a quick look at it this morning and there we go unfortunately it's not a shiny but i have been seeing quite a few of these in the wild which is good to see given that you know over the last couple of years they have been more of a rare uh, ghost type spawn during this event so fingers crossed i'll actually get the shiny this year because yeah, I would really like the shiny. Uh, check the IVs, it is... It's okay. It's half decent, so we'll hold on to it. Uh, and as you can see, there's actually the Halloween-themed stuff going on in the overworld as well. The Pokestops have themed um, pumpkins in their orange and stuff like that. And the gyms also have, like, the pumpkins underneath. And just the general vibe is a very sort of Halloweenish vibe. Collect like these... Last bits of the reward. More dust, more XP, and our encounter is with. Oh! Glaring your mask. This can actually be shiny now as well. So, hopefully, we'll be able to encounter some more of these, and fingers crossed we'll actually get one. Because that would be nice. <laughs> one or both of them. Not greedy. Just one. I would suffice with it, just one. So we've got 
the first of our next 40 ghost types, so we'll check this, it is, okay, three stars at least, so I'm not actually sure how many of these I've got, I'll have to go back and have a look and see if I've got any better ones. So again, nice easy task to get done, so I'll head out, get into this, it's also about that time to get some lunch, so I'll probably grab something to eat while I'm at it. Yeah, finish this off, do a little bit more shiny checking. There's also two paid research tasks that we can do during this event as well, but I thought I would keep that separate from the video, probably do them over the weekend during a live stream with you guys, see if we can get them both finished. There is one based on your mask and then the other one's more of just a Halloween themed one. So yeah, we've got some interesting stuff to do. So like I said, we'll get back into this, we'll finish off this next part of the quest. Hopefully we can come across some more shinies. A little longer than a few minutes later. So unfortunately, I have not come across any more shinies for the day so far, but we do have this next part of the research all done. I'm lunched, feeling a little bit better. I forgot to mention that I was actually feeling crappy before <laughs> when I came out. So yeah, a bit of a migraine and just not feeling well. I'm actually feeling better now that I've had something to eat. So bonus but hopefully we can get shiny bonuses to go along with feeling better bonuses. So we'll grab our dust, we'll get our 40 great balls, which will come in handy given that I've been throwing quite a few blue balls at things lately. And this should be another your mask. Shiny. No. Uh, 403 CP, so I guess we'll check, see if it's actually decent IVs. Given that Cough Egregious is actually not a bad Pokemon for PvP and stuff like that, so definitely worth getting a decent one. I actually don't think I do have a decent one. So, look, three stars, it's, it's okay. I'll have to check some of the ones that I've actually been catching during the day as well and see if any of them are any good. Get out a Galarian, your mask as well. The game is a little bit laggy today. I think it's just because it's so warm. In the car, not shiny. Disappointing. And a 396. So, hopefully this is going to be good because Runegregus is actually fairly good for PvP and stuff like that as well, if I remember correctly. Don't quote me on that. Alright, and this is... Uh, not good at all. So, we'll just forget that that ever happened and... <laughs> go on to this last bit of the research that we actually have to do something for. Uh, so, this last bit of the research, uh, catch another 40 ghost type Pokemon, catch 9 different ghost types, and use 49 berries. So again, very simple things to get done, like I said earlier. It's, it's a research that you can get done in like one afternoon quite easily, which has been good, given the way that I've been feeling. I've been contemplating whether or not I was actually going to get it done or not, but I think... I think I've got enough beans in me now to keep going and getting this done. So, I'll keep at it. Like I said, if I find any more shinies, I'll let you guys know. Uh, and yeah, we'll pick it up from there. I'm just really vibing this, this Halloween background sort of thing. Hopefully they do more of this sort of stuff moving forward. And we see something for Christmas and it's all like festive and Christmas and festive Festivus for Christmas. Uh, you know what I'm saying. And then, yeah, just like Easter and other sorts of events like that. So, yeah. Awesome. Let's keep at it. Well, that was pretty good timing. I have just finished doing this research and I was just heading to the supermarket to grab a couple of things before finishing off for the day. And I found a shiny. So, we have our second shiny for the day. This is a shiny Duskull. So, I mean, at least it's a ghost type Pokemon. Uh, this is my second shiny skull and like the last couple of weeks I got one at PAX last week as, as well but yeah nice we ended up getting another shiny so I'll definitely definitely take that uh, so we'll give him a golden Raz, normal pokeball combination like usual but yeah I'm starting to like feel a bit crappy again so I was contemplating wrapping it up like heading home and you know wrapping it up for the day and all that sort of stuff so this is like perfect timing to get this right now so check the stats and it's actually surprising because i haven't really seen a lot of dust skulls for the day i've probably seen more dust clops than i have dust skulls i've seen like four or five uh, dust clops even like a pair of them sitting together on a stop earlier which is something that you don't see very often so yeah the stats on that suck unfortunately but we do have our shiny boy so we'll star that one 
And I suppose while we're here, we may as well collect this research. So we'll grab our Stardust. We'll grab our normal Pokeballs. Get our encounters with our Yamasks. Can we go back to back shinies? That would be... That would be some epicness. The first one is... Not shiny. No. That is what it is. That's okay. Alright, so... Does this at least have decent stats? It is... Okay. That's not too bad. Again, like I said before, I need to go through and check some more of them for the day. But we'll hold on to that one for now. We'll go on to our G mask. Stardust. XP. Encounter with a non... Shiny Galarian, your mask. <laughs> That's okay. I mean, I suppose I can't get too greedy since we just got a shiny, but I mean, getting new shinies is what we would prefer. Okay, that's actually half decent. So I think that one might be our best one for now. So we'll definitely start that one and like before I go through, check them, all of that sort of goodness. Now, on to this last bit of research. So that's it. We have finished with our research. We collect out. Last bit of research, um, last bit of XP, I should say. And get our final encounter. So, your mask candy, some more XP, and fingers crossed for the shiny. It is not shiny. Uh, and only 390 CP, so we already know that this isn't really going to be that good. So, I guess we will leave it there. And yeah, I'm going to head to the supermarket and grab these things that I need. I guess I'll stay out for a little bit longer. Granted, how I feel, all that sort of stuff. See if I can magically come across more shinies. I mean, we've had a good run, so I shouldn't be pushing my luck, but we'll see how we go. Uh, and yeah, if not, we'll just wrap it up here. So yeah, I'll let you guys know <laughs> if we get any more shinies. If not, thank you for tuning in once again, guys. Enjoy your morning, evening, noon or night. Stay safe, happy hunting. Good luck with your shiny hunting over this Halloween event. All that good stuff. And I'll see you again soon. Peace out. Bye. Thank you.